Hi, I'm Pastor Glenn from Enon Baptist Church. I'd like to talk to you today about one of uh, our favorite scriptures, Romans 8:28, which says, <clears throat> and we know that all things work together for good to those who love God, to those who are the called according to his purpose. I'd like to talk a moment about that passage just briefly. Um, the idea of knowing uh, is a very interesting idea. We either know something by experience or by revelation. And we're told just prior to this verse that we don't know how to pray. We don't know what we should pray for. We don't know completely the will of God. So we rely very heavily on the Holy Spirit to um, intercede for us and uh, help us with our prayers. But what we do know is that all things work together for good, those who to those who love God. And they don't just happen by themselves. These things work together like one big woven fabric, uh, everything working in harmony with each other to produce good in our lives because God is doing it. So God works all things together for good um, according to his purposes. And his purposes uh, are not always our purposes or our wishes or our preferences. And so uh, we need to learn to define a blessing and something as good for us uh, according to uh, whether it matches up with God's will. And so <clears throat> we know things work together for our good. I'd like to also say that um, our present suffering is endurable because we know that even suffering is good. Now that sounds um, far-fetched and it sounds hard to understand and only Christians can grasp uh, something that is uh, in, entails suffering and still call it good. Uh, we're not in denial. Uh, we're like Peter uh, who could not perceive on his own how Christ's dying in, in Jerusalem could possibly be uh, good or according to God's will. But <clears throat> that is the case and Peter would come to know by experience the value and the good in it uh, as he learned uh, the rest of the gospel. So I'd like to encourage you to uh, look at examples in your own life of things that you don't initially see as good but remember according to the promise that God has made to us in his word uh, even the things that involve suffering are God working behind the scenes to fulfill his purposes. And we can embrace that and, and really be glad for it. God bless you and may God fulfill all his purposes for you.